All new at six, Milton firefighters suspect lightning strikes are responsible for two apartment fires in just four days. The first one was last Friday at Camden Deerfield off Summit Boulevard and the second on Tuesday at IMT Deerfield just up the road. Chopper 46 getting a look at the damage. Tonight, CBS 46's Mary Smith tells us how you can help the families affected and prevent tragedy in your own home. We spoke with several families who no longer have homes after a suspected lightning strike hit a building here at IMT Deerfield in Milton. Firefighters tell us it's the second building to be struck in less than a week in this area. Cell phone video shot by a witness shows an apartment building at IMT Deerfield in Milton burning Tuesday. We hear like a lightning strike and it sounded like it hit close. Schechter says she, her husband and their six year old son ran for safety after realizing the building was on fire. Tonight they have no home. I mean, it's horrible. Um, our son is six years old and he's grown up here. He's been here since he was six months old. Misty and Lily Reynolds were on vacation in Florida when they received a call they never thought they'd get. She said, Misty, your ha our apartment's on fire, our apartment's on fire. It was just sad, you know, I, there's no tears now because I've cried and lost my voice and, and been crying for days. Chopper 46 surveyed the damage. You can see two large burnt pits in the building. Lightning struck the same complex about a year ago, burning another building across the street, displacing about 40 people. It's the second one in Milton in a four day span. Firefighters suspect both are from lightning. So that's the first time that it's happened with apartment complex. They, they were maybe a mile from each other. Marietta says no one was injured, but dozens of people lost everything. Now donations are piling up at Milton's fire stations. Milton fire officials say they need bed sheets, towels and other household items. Georgia is the second or third most struck state in the country. Atlanta Lightning Protection says there are ways to protect you and your home from a dangerous strike. This is what is going to intercept the lightning strike. It's going to go up in the top of your house. And then once this intercepts the lightning, it's going to travel cable down and then into a ground rod inside your house. And the donation drive through the Milton Fire Department continues through next Friday. In Milton, Mary Smith, CBS 46 News.